Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more Final Fantasy VII uh, Rebirth. And uh, we're here in Gungaga, a beautiful little village here in the middle of the jungles. Um, so yeah, we're going to explore this area a little bit. Those Gungaga mushrooms you found? They're all yours if you want them. We got more than our fair share. Thank you. And uh, it did say that we have some Queen's Blood people that we can play, so Today, you know that's what we're gonna going to do. I'm going to teach you about an important part of our history, about the terrible accident that forever changed Gungaga and her people. I'm sure all of you know about our Mako reactor. Okay! Okay, another town of that was damaged by Shinra's shoddy work with their Mako reactors. Oh, God damn it, Chadley. Why are you here? Get out of here, Chadley. I hope Chadley dies by the end of this game. <laughs> so in the next game, he never shows up. Why, hello, Cloud. The tires are read, which means you can explore. This also means you can gather more detailed intel about the desert for me. All right, Badland Beasts. That was a new one we unlocked. Cloud, Aerith, and Yuffie. Let's try that out. See how that goes. Okay, lots of fire. This ends here. Get ready. Gotcha. No You're dead. Here we go now. Shit. Gotcha. No holding back. Get him. It's on now. You're to describe me. I'm thinking legendary. All right, we need to focus down one of these guys. Inflicting enough damage while they are breathing fire will pressure them. When their HP gets low, they will enter the explosion imminent. Okay. Let's go. Was that it? Go on! Gotcha. Sorry. You had your chance. Here we go. No holding back. Now. Let's finish this. Sorry. This one's for you. You need to kill me, Chili. Shit. Get ready. Get on Give me a break. Sorry. Moving on then. Yeah, nice try. Not today, sir, not today. Okay, still fire, right? Here we go. This ends here. 
Let's do this. Was that it? All right. With me. Good time. You're dead. Let's do this. It's on now. Ain't dead yet. No escape, that's it. It's on now. Forgetting to use haste. Okay, AP up materia. Um, actually, we should, probably should be using that. I need to check who has that right now because we might be wasting it at the moment because we haven't checked in a while. Okay. Oh yeah, combat training. Kate Sith. Let's uh, let's do this. Teach me how to use this guy because I clearly don't know how. <laughs> Press square to perform combo attacks with Kate Sith's megaphone. Hold it down to unleash a magical sound wave that harms nearby opponents. Pressing square after dodging will also unleash a magical sound wave. Press triangle while Kate Sith is by himself to execute Kitty Wallop, a pouncing attack. He can also summon a Moogle to fight alongside him. Oh, cool! And it like juggles them too. Probably doesn't do that to bigger enemies, but still. Let's Ride summons a giant Moogle to fight alongside Kate Sith. While on the field, the Moogle will attack enemies independently. It will withdraw from the battle once its HP reaches zero, but can be summoned again at will. Using Let's Ride while the Moogle is summoned will restore, fully restore its HP and remount Kate Sith if he is not already mounted. Some of Kate Sith's abilities, including his Limit Break, can only be used while the Moogle is on the field. Activating one of these Moogle abilities will cause Kate Sith to automatically hop aboard his plush pal. Here we go. Kate Sith will immediately hop onto his Moogle once it is summoned but can dismount by pressing circle and remount with triangle. While riding the Moogle, press square to attack alongside your plush pal, hold it down to initiate a combo. Targeting the same foe will, while mounted will increase the power of your attacks and fill the ATB gauge faster. Okay, that's good to know. Dismounting will allow you to choose separate targets. Okay, that was me holding square that did that combo. Seem pretty strong. Of course, these are weaker enemies, so it's hard to really get a gauge for it. As the Moogle attacks, the Moogle meter will continue to fill. Press triangle while mounted to deplete the meter and activate a Moogle ability. So the, does the meter have to be full? The default level one ability is Dropkick, a powerful physical attack. Okay. 
Kate Sith can learn other abilities as well, including dodge and dive to evade an attack, then counter with a reckless charge, after which the Moogle will withdraw. Can only use while the Moogle is on the field. Roll of the dice, roll a die, the resulting effect varies depending on which number appears. Fire and Thunder, Hyper Beam, Arrow and Blizzard, Total Outrage, Regenerative Aura, and Expansive Shield. Alright, cool. <laughs> You're gonna love this one! Right to warn ya! Let's consult the dice! Arrow and Blizzard. That deserves a round of applause! Okay, some more luck up materia. Isn't that like three that we have now? Okay, at any cost, enemy skill self-destruct. Um, these ones that give enemy skills tend to be quite diff a little bit difficult. Um, this one only is a time limit one. Okay. Landing synergy abilities will pressure it. Gotcha. Take the lead. I'll fight fifth and four for you. Brace yourself. I'll knock your block off. There. Let's do this. Okay, Tifa needs one more. Extend stagger. Good stuff. Well done, team. Let's keep it up. Okay, self destruct. Not that I'm going to use that. Seems like a bad call. <laughs> All right. I need to check Thanks on to you. my archives are filling up. I look forward to.
All right, who has the all or the AP up? Um, let's see, right there, AP. All right, it is being used here, good. Um, we should probably use it on something else too. We have another AP up materia. Um, it's being used on Thunder and Arrow. Who has... Who has that one that has silence? You do. Okay. We're gonna swap. Boom. Okay, we'll work on that. Okay, you've got a maxed out lightning materia. You're going to take that, and then you, Fee, you're going to take one of the clean ones. Should just be swapping them, but doesn't doesn't matter too much. Ah, wrong button. Bloody hell, doesn't matter. Okay. Aerith, I think I'm going to give you a cure, finally. <laughs> I love prey, but sometimes we just need the cure. Okay, triangle is swap, not square. I keep thinking it's square for some reason, and I don't know why. But let's do, do that, because you are on the field so often that we should have you leveling sh shit up always. Yeah. Okay, cool. Seeing what new discoveries you make in your travels. Cloud, you may now fight Kuch- I encourage you to pit your skills against this summoned entity so that I might complete its materia. Okay, quake magic, that's cool. Um, we've also got magic focus, increase potency and duration of linked materia spells by 5%. Limit siphon, use limit siphon. Allows you to absorb an ally's limit gauge to fill your own? Okay, that's interesting. 
Then Synergy Support Materia. Increase Synergy by one when other party members use a Synergy ability during battle. I'm just going to ignore Sand Slithers for a little bit longer, because I hate it. And we're going to ignore Alexander for a minute, too, because I don't want to do that one right now. <laughs> okay. I wish you all the best in your ongoing hunt for we'll do it soon. <laughs> you doing okay? So, so bored. Bored right out of my brain. If I don't... Die first, that y'all go insane. Cause I've got nothing else to do. I'm stuck, you're wasting time. But just wait, oh materia. I'll get back on the road and make you mine. It's a nice song there. I am so. <laughs> Nice song, funny too. Nice song, funny too. Wrote it yourself? <laughs> Finally, someone recognizes my genius. Yeah, that's the word I'd use. The amazing Yuffie is also a top tier lyricist. Oh, I've got another song. Want to hear it? Oh dear. Sure. Here goes. I'll search high and low till I've gathered them all. I'll have orbs piled up about a billion feet tall. I'll have so much materia. I won't know what to do. We're going to walk away slowly. But until I can make you mine, I'll just patiently wait and dream of you. Well done, girl. Bird of Prey. Nice. It's been a while since we had a new weapon, huh? Uh, whoops, I don't know why I went to Tifa there. I just saw black hair, I didn't even read the name. <laughs> okay, Bird of Prey. We have four slots here. It has Doppelganger. Conjure a clone of yourself that temporarily mimics your actions. Can use while airborne. Very nice. Proficiency bonus, finish off an enemy while the clone is present. Ice and lightning damage, MP recovery rate, critical hit rate, critical hit damage, limit break. Let's uh, lean into the crit. Why not? Okay. You know, with her setup, she really shouldn't have the this materia, the enemy skill. Um, oh, God damn it, I keep on thinking that's switch. It's really not switch. Triangle. Not square. All right, let's switch this with something that you have. We gotta go and find Queen's blood. <laughs> Let's get to the real game. Let's go. None of this fine Sephiroth side business. This. Hey there. Good to see you again. Since you're here, mind if I snap a pic of a fun guy with some fun guy? Oh, kill him. 
<laughs> Why, Cloud? You chose that. Nobody asked Feels you to like do that. Time passes slower here. You chose that. Especially compared to the city. Everyone seems so at peace. I'd love to get a shot that captures the atmosphere. If you come across a spot that might look good in photos, I'd love to hear about it. Okay, that's pretty far south. Got a ways to go to get to that. What do we got here? All right, the Pursuit of Perfection, level 31, independent weapon, Smith Gungaga Izo Smithery. I've been striving to create the greatest weapon that ever was, but despite my best efforts, I've yet to make any meaningful progress. There's an essential element I'm missing, the seed of inspiration, but I know it's out there. I just need something or someone to help me grasp it. You're here again? Playing me'd be a waste of both my time and yours. If you want to go around with me, then you'll have to earn it. You must be Blood Tactician level 8 to challenge her? I've already beaten her. You can't act like she's awesome when I kicked her ass on that boat. This was mine, right? If you weren't awake, you are now. You got the strong stuff, huh? They got that strong moonshine. That there is a fine tomato. It's springtime, boys. And I think Once things settle down, I could see myself moving out here, living off the land. Be a nice change of pace. <laughs> Just me, Marlene, and our little piece of paradise. <laughs> Wonder what kind of stuff we'd end up growing. Mushrooms. Mushrooms. What? Cause it's our lucky food? Don't tell me you believe that mumbo jumbo. Still, you might be onto something. Gungaga mushroom farming sounds like a license to print gear. <laughs> <laughs> that laugh though. Shinra's doing its damnedest to bleed the planet dry, but she's still got life in her, and we gotta help her keep what's left. Hey, where's the queen's blood? People, Every now and then where's it at? Oh, there it's at. Near the reactor. Hmm? <coughs> What's the matter, Oscar? Do you want to play a game? Oh, Oscar, I'm going to feel bad beating you. Ah, you there. Don't ask how I can tell, but you're into queen's blood, aren't you? Isn't that great, Oscar? I found someone you can play against. <coughs> Let me introduce you. This is Oscar the Swift. He's a watch chocobo, a huge Queen's Blood fan too. He gets cranky if he can't play at least one game a day. So, how about it? Mind going around with him? Okay, let's do it. We'll rank up if we can beat three more. We're gonna get a Griffin card, replace an ally, and raise the power of allied cards on affected tiles by the replaced ally's power, okay? We'll try and make it work. Lock myself off. He's going to be able to take that bottom, probably. 
All right, that wasn't my smartest move. That, though. Hmm. It's my best bet of winning, I feel like, so. Unless that thing can jump. Oh no! Rude. <laughs> Alright, he won. Well played. What's your power again? Raise power by one for each enhanced enemy enemy card, okay. Let's uh, go for board control. You just gave up your board, dude. I don't know what he was thinking. He's got more replacement cards? It's not enough, bro. Good effort, though. I'm sorry, Oscar. Okay, new replacement card. Whoa! This is the first time I've ever seen Oscar lose! Didn't expect that. <laughs> Seems like he's a little bitter. <laughs> anyway, thanks so much for indulging him. I'm sorry, he Oscar. It's a lot harder for us to do our jobs when he's in a mood. <laughs> really? Believe it or not, he's gonna make his television debut soon. He'll be up against a dog that plays Queen's Blood. We met that we dog. have to make sure he wins to help drive up tourism here. <laughs> He'll pull it off. You ever heard of that? Maybe I should splurge for once and get the premium fee. We don't stop at your normal sundries. We sell materia too. Give me that. Give me that booster pack. Have yourself a good day. And don't be a stranger. You ever heard of that blacksmith named Hanzo? 
Well, maybe you haven't heard of him, but you've heard him if you've spent time with him. Okay. So, yep, we need to check out this building. Needless to say, he's a black sheep. No better way to stay off boredom than a nice... Please, browse at your leisure. I'll be right here if you need anything. See ya. If you need something else, you know where to find us. All we can do is trust that the Coalition will get to the bottom of all this weirdness. Bigger town than I was expecting. Let's get started with some practice swings. Coalition training. Hey, here we go. Hey there! You treating your chocobos right? Um, can you give me a quest on where to find my chocobo for this region? Please? Take good care of your choco buddies! Guess not, huh? If you want to visit the reactor, you'll have to get Sisney's permission first. Coalition sent a team to investigate the reactor. See what's going on. How's it going, guys? I'm thinking this could finally be our time to shine. Time to get these birds looking spiffy. See the piano. Yes. Cinco de Chocobo. This one's going to be a quick one. Uh-oh. Why is there no restart for this? I tried to use the left stick for some of those. My bad. That was tough. Missed that top note.
Those last notes always get me. I'm like, I'm done. And then they always do one more last little bit. All right, cool. Um, let's see, we missed three. Usually we're missing like two or three. So that's pretty on par for, for my norm. Okay. Got the A rank. I'll take it. It's so funny because like the mini games that I love, I guarantee other people are going to hate and vice versa. <laughs> There's no finer sound in all the world than the voice of a humble piano. And I love the piano. All right, so let's see. There's only two more after this. That makes me sad. Mellifluous melodies are all the more pleasing when played. I like on that the these piano. come in uh, two stars. Thank you for sharing such joy with the. I hope you will enchant us with even more splendid performances in time. You got it, Dorian. I've got at least two more in me. Hey, Tifa. See how they dry their mushrooms here? Bet they'd make for a mean stock. Hell Doubt yeah. There's much it wouldn't improve. Soups, pilafs. Maybe even a pop roast. Oh, I love mushrooms so what much. What sort of thing would you go oh, for? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Um, pot roast. I'm gonna go with All of the them. pot roast. All of them. Ah, why does that not surprise me? I remember mom saying how Claudio's was the best she'd ever had. Oh. If you tell me what it was like, I could try and make it for you. Oh my God. Please. Imagine eating Gungaga mushrooms every day. Now that's- Now that one didn't say you. that I got a relationship up. So I wonder if that was a bad option for- relationship up here. These rooms are hmm. specialty. All right. Tifa romance is out the window now. We, we screwed it up. It's over. Children of the planet, open your hearts to the is there only the one player here? Where, where are the rest of them? Where's the rest of the Queen's Blood players? Mmm. Mmm. All right, we're gonna we're gonna go and see about that in a minute. You expect me to remember? Huh? It's been ages. And oh, Cloud. Friend of yours? Come in. Please. Hmm? Your eyes. You're a soldier, aren't you? Um, was. You wouldn't happen to know our son, would you? Zach? Are you all right? Said the name, Zach. Fine. What did you say his name was? Zack. Zack Fair. Fair. Zack? Oh, are we Sorry. gonna get a flash? Oh, no. come on. Our son just up and left one day, determined to chase his dreams. At first, he wrote us all the time, but... When I first saw you, I thought, maybe this is the girl he was always talking about. Oh. Sorry if I made you feel uncomfortable. I doubt I was the only woman in his life. Charming guy like Zack. <sighs> <laughs> Wherever he is, I hope he's enjoying himself at least. They do say no news is good news, right? They sure do. Say, if you do happen to see Zack, would you tell him that we miss him and to please get in touch? Of course I will. We should probably be heading back, don't you think? What? Already? At least have something to eat before you go. Thanks, but we don't want to keep our friends waiting. <laughs> Another time, then. <laughs> Man, they're just drip-feeding us. 
keep wanting more. Here. This is the middle entry of a trilogy in a game that was originally just one game, so... I think that it's natural that, like, we're getting just a lot of plot, but not a ton of progression. It's just the nature of it, but... I'm finding myself getting a little bit annoyed at the pace. Like, they're drip-feeding us so hard. And even the flashes to the other timeline is giving us so little to chew on. I really hope we get something meaty soon. The plot stuff that's happening is so good, though. Like, if you've... Uh, here's the thing, is, like, I think that that works for me because I played the original game. So I'm going to be less forgiving of it. But I wonder if other people are feeling that drip feed worse than me because they don't... They don't have the connection to the original game, so they don't, like, see the way that it's changed. Like, or, well, the way that it's been updated, right? Like, the the, the way that it's been blown out, right? But Sorry. I don't know. Let me know Every what you think in the comments. says they're from Midgar, we can't help but hope that person knows our son. A couple of bumpkins like us often forget it's a big city. All this talk of another war has me worried. But I know I'm not the only mother afraid for her son. All right. You okay, Aerith? Hey. That wasn't very nice of me. You remember me telling you about Zack, right? At the playground? How... He was my first love. I do remember that. And uh, as she said the name, he had one of those one of those moments, one of those Mako poisoning moments. And so we never got to hear the name. And I, of course, knew what name she was saying because I've played the game. But first love, Zach Fair. Yeah. This is where he grew up. And now that I'm here, it's... A lot. So when I saw someone who looked like him, I don't know. I had to say something. Didn't even occur to me to think how they would feel about it. Pretty selfish, huh? Waltzing in there, stirring up memories. You're too hard on yourself. Bet it was good for them to get it all out. I hope you're right. So, this Zack guy, you still like him? <laughs> <laughs> wow. You went there, huh? <laughs> he went there. <laughs> Maybe. He's never given me a reason not to. That's really sweet. <sighs> Any news? Nothing. No calls, no letters. So they had their talk. That happened off screen. Remember on the boat when they said that they wanted to talk about boys? Clearly they had that conversation. And she told Tifa about Zack. Oh. Leaving you out in the cold like this? Forget about that loser. Hmm? <laughs> he's a soldier, right? Then I hate to break it to you. But if he's been gone this long, the man is dead. Don't say that to her. Come on, man. Cloud? The fuck is wrong with you? Sorry. Did you forget I'm the part? Like first that. love? Come on, man. Have some tact. Well, <sighs> here's that up. He definitely doesn't know who Zack is. You gotta get Another your time. You gotta get your shit together, bro. You gotta get your shit together. Ah, <sighs> rest at Cisne's place. Mm. 
my, my, what a trek you must have made to get here. You know, we, where is, this is the GYC, God damn. We never ran into Red, and we also never ran into, um, Kate. Maybe let's go back up here and do a loot, see if they're around here. Hmm, maybe they're not around. Oh, there we go. There's one. Telling species apart can be difficult. What looks like a Gungaga mushroom may in fact be poisonous. For me and my nose, the difference is obvious. But for someone like you, well, let's find out. <laughs> Which of these do you think they are? Um... Not the ones on the left, right? Well, actually, they might be the ones on the left. Did they have kind of a curved top? Those have spots, which has me concerned about them. Those kind of have spots, too. I think it is this one. I don't know. Let's try it. One's on the left. Anyone with eyes can see that. So, you have a death wish. I must say, that's troubling <laughs> to learn. A word of advice, Cloud. Do not, under any circumstances, consume wild mushrooms. <laughs> We'll Thanks. ask you first, buddy. I'll, I'll try not to. We failed. Sorry, but sorry, bro. The soil here is exceptionally easy on the paws, as if it exudes life itself. Well, with the reactor gone, it's probably in better shape than most places, huh? Huh, I don't know where Kate is. Maybe we can't even do conversations with Kate. Imagine eating Gungaga mushrooms every day. Now that's luxury for you. Oh. Okay, not down there either. Have been acting strange recently, probably because of the reactor noise that's replacing people. All right, we're gonna go and rest. It's springtime, boys. Tonight. Don't forget to try some of our homegrown produce. I am so. So bored. We know. Bored right out of my brain. We know, Yuffie. <laughs> I don't. Pipe down. I'm trying to sleep. Get some rest until it's time to leave. Guess we're going then. Let's go. Something's up with the reactor. Well, you. Hey, you hear that? Yeah, gotta be a weapon. something about this could say that yeah you've been hearing it for a while for a few days now yeah the coalition tried to investigate but some creatures kept us from getting into the reactor though all they did was fly around just the sight of those weird black wisps was enough black enough. wisps no ain't that something you could see them the wisps are supposed to be gone yeah of course 
Why? Do you know what they are? <sighs> Whispers. <laughs> well, this just got more interesting. So, when do we leave? You young lady are on guard duty. No, oh, come on. I just want to help out. Be a part of the team. Yeah, because you've been a real team player. <laughs> Keep an eye on her for us. I'll do my best. Let's just get in, take a look, and get out. Figure you, me, Kate, and Red can do that easy. Agreed? Agreed. So is Tifa staying behind too? Let's go. You guys hold down the fort. Okay, Cloud Barrett and Kate. Can I switch them out if I want to? Yes, you can edit party, okay. We'll try that for now. The hell? You heard that, right? What in the world is that? There it is again. Something to do with the reactor, isn't it? Just head straight south. The guard knows you're coming. All right. So we're gonna head to the, the reactor. Me in. You can head on through. But we need to end the episode here, so this is where we're going to do that. Thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Have a good one, everybody. Bye. I'd like to give a very special shout-out to my patron supporters, Darren York, ZTD, Knife Namase, Kyle the Monarch, Chris Murphy, JW, Quinless, Vlado101, Andy Ford, Bruce Wizzle, Black Mamba90, Eureka Gecko, A Happy Fat Panda, Pedo Kuto, Shadow Raven, Anna Kate the Great, Emily Kuzanoa, Philip Dowdy, Timothy Jansen, Skip, Daniel, St. Germain Soleil, and Nadia N. If you would also like to join this tier or any others, check out my memberships or my Patreon in the description down below.